Hey guys, Black Six from BZ Power here with some news I am super excited to share. Uh, we finally have some official information and images of the upcoming uh, Saturn V set from LEGO Ideas. So as you can see, uh, it is set 21309. It contains 1,969 pieces and will retail for $120 when it comes out in June of this year, June 1st. Um, it's pretty awesome that they made the piece count 1969 since that is the year that man landed on the moon. Super nice touch. Uh, you can see on the packaging that there's a little bit of everything in this set. We've got the Saturn V, we've got the command module, we've got the lunar lander. Um, this is a giant model. Uh, I'm not sure how well the images are kind of going to give you that sense of scale, um, but according to all of the uh, documentation around the press release, it is over three feet tall. It is 39 inches tall. That may make it the largest Lego set ever, um, but you know, I'm super fine with that because it, this is ridiculous. Um, I'm a huge fan of the Apollo program. I think that landing on the moon is one of mankind's uh, greatest achievements and uh, super excited by this model and how awesome it looks. Uh, just the, the, the sheer level of detail that they were able to capture, the way that the uh, different stages actually separate. Um, you have the Saturn 4B booster, the Saturn 2, the Saturn 1, um, and of course the command module and the lunar module, and even the escape engine. Uh, so it's pretty crazy. Uh, just the amount of detail. I'm sure most of those parts you see with the American flag and the USA and everything, those are probably all going to be printed, uh, since that is what we've come to expect from LEGO Ideas. So a lot of new, cool printed parts. Uh, so lots of great details uh, from that for builders. Uh, here we see a little kind of vignette of the lunar module. Um, I love the printed boat bottom piece they're using for that and the printed micro figs for the astronauts. Of course technically there should only be two astronauts since only two of the three Apollo crew members landed on the moon. Also love that one by two trans clear tile with the American flag print. Another nice touch. Just in general like a you know, huge amount of uh, detail in a fairly small model for the lunar module here. Lots of nice gold parts for the um, shielding, heat shielding on there. And, uh, you know, maybe some nice, uh, I'm not sure how many recolors there are for the gray, but definitely some nice uh, gold parts in there. And those microfig prints look uh, pretty on top of things considering how small uh, those figures are. So very nice, um, very awesome. And of course, we also have a little vignette of the command module on Splashdown. So they use the uh, click hinge pieces for the uh, inflatable um, airbags to keep it upright and uh, some bionicle uh, ball joints for the uh, drogue chutes and the uh, additional inflation. Uh, some nice printing there on the command module door. Uh, very simple build compared to the lunar module, but still uh, you know, nice, and I love that. Um, uh, I don't know, it looks like it's probably about like an 8x8 eight eight, uh, round tile that they uh, set it up on. Um, and so finally, we've got the Saturn V broken down. Uh, you can see it comes with stands, so you can display it on its side in case you don't have a space to uh, store a three foot tall model. So I think that's really awesome. Not sure how I'm going to display it, but uh, you know, definitely some good options there. This is an amazing set. I'm super excited about it. You can be sure that we will do a live build of it once we're able to get our hands on it. Thanks again for LEGO to uh, sh for sharing this information and uh, really excited for June 1st.